Hola a todos. Okay, so these are going to be stem changing verbs. So they're in the present tense, and the thing with stem changing verbs is they are exactly what they sound like. The stem changes. So if you remember what a stem is, uh, if you don't, we're about to go over it. But if you remember what a stem is, it is this. We have our infinitive, like hablar, and or an infinitive like comer, or like vivir. And what we do is we remove basically our last two letters. Okay, the AR, the ER, the IR, and we're left with what is called the stem. So for our blood, our stem would be H-A-B-L, for comer, C-O-M, for vivir, V-I-V. Okay? So these are our stems. Now, with stem changing verbs, what happens is they change. And there are four types. Okay? The four types are O to U E, E to I, E to A, and there's actually only one of these, and it is U to U E. Okay? So, let me erase this, and then we'll lay across top, and I'll give you some examples of each one. Okay? So, for that O to U E, let's say we have the verb, I'll write it a little bit bigger. Dormir. Dormir means to sleep. Okay? And the stem is going to change from O to UE. So our stem, let's just start off by finding our stem. Our stem is what? You got it? DRM. Because we take off the IR, the last two, and we're left with DORM. Okay? Now, one of the key things you need to know about stem changing verbs is that they do not ever, ever, ever change with nosotros. Okay? So some people call these boot verbs because of this. And I'll explain the boot in a second as soon as I finish drawing. So if you notice, nosotros is up here. That's how we've always done it at the top right corner is nosotros. So if you were to like remove these two boxes, you have the shape of a boot, okay? So some people call these boot verbs because the stem change happens in this boot. It happens with I, you, he, she, they, and y'all. Does not happen with we, okay? It will never, ever, ever happen with we. Does not happen with nosotros, okay? So here, if I wanna say I sleep, I just change my O to a UE, and now it's duermo, okay? Same thing here, if I wanna say you sleep, duermes. He or she sleeps, duerme. They or y'all sleep, duermen. And then we sleep stays the same and it is dormimos. Okay? Now, if you notice the endings don't change at all, it is just the stem. Okay? So we are still using the exact same endings that we've been using. The stem is just going to change a little bit with these verbs. Okay? And there are, again, four groups O to U E, E to I, E to A, and then there's just one that goes U to U E. Okay? And I'll go ahead and write some of those out. Here. Let me step off to the side so you can see that for a moment. You can pause it if you need to. You can look at it. You can manipulate this video however you see fit. Okay. And do these. Okay. Now, the one and only that goes U to UE is this one. Jugar, okay? That is the one and only that goes U to UE. And that means to play, so like when I say, que juegas, what do you play? Okay. Um, there are a few more that go E to I, like pedir, um, repetir, to order or to ask for is pedir, repetir is to repeat. Um, and I'm not going to list all of them, okay? I'm just going to list some of the ones that you're going to see most commonly right now, okay? There's some that you might see on the quiz on Friday, okay? Um, for EI, we have preferir, um, empezar, 
um, querer, okay? preferir is what it looks like, it's to prefer, empezar is to begin, um, querer is to want. Uh, Oriui, of course we've got dormir, the one we just did, you've got contar, and then you've got uh, almorzar. Okay. Almorzar is to eat lunch, contar is to count, dormir is to sleep. Okay. And I'll, let me get one more to put here, and then those will be the ones that you're going to be responsible for for the quiz on Friday. Um, shoot, I'm drawing a blank. Um, I will have to post one more along with this when I post the video um, for EDI. But these are it. Uh, again, there are more examples of these verbs, um, but I'm drawing a, a real big blank right now um, on EDI. So, ODUE. Ida-ai, ida a, ida -a ida They're all based on finding your stem, then making your change with everything except for nosotros. Again, remember that boot shape, if you want to remember it that way. There are quite a different ways you can memorize this. Um, if you want to just memorize that they change with everything but nosotros, you can. If you want to memorize that it's the shape of a boot off of the chart, you can. Um, if you just want to memorize that they are stem changing verbs and we find our stem and we change it, you can. Okay. So, up to you how you want to do it. Um, but Make sure you practice them, go on to the links, use them to help you out, and then make sure that you take the worksheet and do it and attach it back for credit. Okay, adios.